Hey, Chief. Tell him. Say, um, I'm not mean. I'm just very protective of my people. And um, a Rottweiler is a very stubborn animal. Um, you know, the Bible talks about stubbornness in people being not good. Um, 1 Samuel chapter 15, of course, it talks about how rebellion is the sin of witchcraft, is as the sin of witchcraft, and of course, um, stubbornness being like idolatry. I'm like, really? Yeah. Check it out. But, um, Chief pretty much will stick with me. Uh, he has to have a bucket of water at all times, of course. He'll He'll actually, in the summertime, get in the water and just bathe in it. Sometimes I think he's part Labrador Retriever. But uh, as long as he doesn't see a threat and he doesn't feel like um, anybody is uh, bothering me, he'll just go lay down take a nap. But if he hears something or he sees something, um, man's best friend. And I can guarantee you this is a big dog you do not want jumping you in the dark or for that matter in the daylight so uh last time he went to the vet he was 140 pounds and uh we don't overfeed him he's just a big dog he's not um he's not overly heavy he's not fat he's just a big dog oh what a big oh and a puppy and a big puppy what a big puppy you are you're such a puppy you're such a puppy. Oh, look at that big puppy. What a big sweet puppy you are. Now, I would not suggest that you attempt this at all with Chief. Because I'll be honest with you. He is definitely a respecter of persons. <laughs> and what I mean by that, he is not like the Lord. The Lord is no respecter of persons. Uh, Chief, he does not respect anybody except for his dad. Jimmy Street is definitely his master. Um, this dog has, uh, <laughs> he's growled at me and, uh, barked at me. Yeah, I think it might have been about food. So, yeah, don't mess with this food. But in terms of him being man's best friend, that's where I was going today. There is a friend that will stick closer than a brother. And that's Yeshua. And I understand that they say dogs are man's best friend. But at the end of the day, Yeshua Hamashiach is my best friend. He's the lover of my soul. And I can guarantee you this dog right here will defend me with his life. And um, I appreciate that. And he would probably lay down his life for me. But at the end of the day, saints, there's only one that died for you. And that's Jesus Christ of Nazareth, who is the Lord of Lords and the King of Kings. And um, I personally know him as my Savior. And I know a lot of you also know him as your Lord and Savior. Um, I don't know if everybody has their own Rottweiler to protect them. But um, when Chief's not around, I got the greatest Rottweiler I could ever have right by my side. That's Holy Spirit. I don't need a Rottweiler. I don't need a 45. I don't need a, a 22 um, hidden under my coat. I don't need any protection other than Holy Spirit and the Holy Angels. Uh, now, believe me, when I say I've been walking in the city and in the town with my Rottweiler and people didn't have a problem with staying away from me, it's kind of funny. Uh, they see a big Rottweiler next to you, and they'll stay away. <laughs> My best buddy here. Chief, what you doing? You're not going to speak for him, are you? Huh? Oh, yeah, there he is. See, all I got to do is say his name. All I got to do is say that name, and he gets right up. Mm, what a sweet baby. Yeah, I baby talk him. He knows he's loved, and he knows who feeds him. And gives him probably too many treats. But, yeah, you know, when I feel along his backbone, he's not, uh, there's no fat there. It's just a solid big dog. 
and he is such a wonderful buddy. You want to go for a walk? Huh? What are you doing? Huh? You're just a big puppy. You're the biggest puppy around here. Yes, you are. Yeah, he scares the neighbor's dog. He scares the neighbor's dog so much that the neighbor's dog has figured he's just not coming back here anymore. But you know what, saints? If you have a best friend and he happens to be a four-legged friend or she, I don't know where the cat is. You know, well, some people like chickens. This is my rooster. Um, no, he's not real. Duh. He's a metal rooster. But, um, hey, he's got something to say. Chief watches over everything. When Jim's not around, he's my best buddy. Well, you understand. Maybe not my best buddy, but he definitely taking care of Mama. So I'm not going to ramble on anymore, saints. Your best friend should be Yashua Hamashiach. It's great to have a best friend. It's great to have friends and relationships. But at the end of the day, they all walk away at some point. They all got their own thing to do. They all get distracted. They all leave. Even if they come back, that's great. But saints, at the end of the day, man's best friend might be a dog. But truly... Man's best friend is Yahshua Hamashiach, who is Jesus the Lord, the Savior, the Master, the only true friend that sticks closer than a brother, a pet. He protects you, he keeps you, he hides you under the wings of his protection. Chief is a great friend. He walks with me and he chases off other dogs, and he won't let anybody else in the yard. I don't care even if he knows you, he's intimidating. But I tell you what, saints, there's no better friend than Yahshua Hamashiach. I love my pets. Love my husband. Love my guns. But you know what? At the end of the day, my only real protection, Yahshua Hamashiach my personal close relationship with him the fact that the comforter comes and keeps me and will never leave me and will never forsake me he'll never disappear to God be the glory in Jesus name it's sister with a testimony just a thought for the day y'all have a blessed day God bless you God bless you God bless you